What's the deal, YouTube? This is your boy Eagle Gamer, and these are going to be my thoughts on Halo 3 and a 10 year anniversary and my experience with Halo 3 and the Halo franchise. So, I'm going to play on one of the Halo 3 maps that I played a lot with my friends after high school, what we do play used to play after high school and whatnot, and what weapons they used in this map and so on. So, Halo 3 is pretty much the biggest Halo game. That's fact. When Halo released in 2007, it had 1 million concurrent players within 24 hours, and I believe it made $300 million within the first week, which is very impressive. Even to this date, it's Microsoft's fifth highest selling exclusive on the 360, and their number one exclusive sold, selling over 14 million copies, which is incredible. Now, Halo 3, I'm a huge Halo fan. I've played all the Halo games, even the spin-offs, I've played all of them. Though, I see the franchises falling a little downwards due to how many Halo games have come out. Wars 5, not my favorite, but still, they got that. So, pretty much, my first Halo game I played was Halo 2. I enjoyed Halo 2 a lot. It was, um, I played it at I after middle school I went to my friend's house and we would play I would play that crap out of that I the first level I played with him was playing as the arbiter which I thought was pretty cool as well I also enjoyed playing the first halo which I brief I pretty much played that on um, the 360 once I picked that up I got now once halo 3 came out um, halo 3 my buddy, my friend in middle school, he bought the, his brother bought him the collector's edition, which was the Halo 3 console, which was green and black. That console was pretty cool. That really cool looking console. As well as he got the Halo 3 game. And I would literally ask him, beg him to have sleepovers at his house so we could play Halo 3. Of course, I decimated a minute which was kind of funny we would spend all night playing Halo 3's multiplayer mostly Griff Ball that was our favorite game mode and the campaign was amazing eventually once I got a job by in high school I picked up a 360 for myself in 2009 and bought Resident Evil 5 and Halo 3 and I enjoyed playing Halo 3 a lot with my brother and my best friend and this map we created together ourselves and the inside of it and so on Even to this day, Halo 3 is still my favorite Halo game, which some people say 2 is, but for me it is definitely 3. Reach was also good, but I felt like Bungie, after they left, Halo hasn't really been the same. I mean, yes, Destiny 2 has 1.3 million concurrent players, however, Halo 3, in its first 24 hours, had a million concurrent players. So that should speak volumes to how big Halo used to be, back when games were kind of in a purity state, you could say. You see, these are all of my friends' main weapons. Each one of them had a different set. There was like five of us, sniper, so on and so forth. My brother used the Elite a lot. And the Needler, of course. As we played more often, um, we sunk hundreds, maybe even thousands of hours into Halo Reach. Every day after school, I either worked or I played Halo with three with my brother or my best friend. And we just enjoyed playing the loading crap out of Halo 3. We literally, we I collected every skull in Halo 3, including the hidden skulls. I beat Legendary, Co-op, and Solo, and I beat Legendary with all the skulls active. I think currently I have 1,320 achievements in Halo 3. That's what I had. That includes the maps. I bought all the maps. <laughs> That's, I did that for all the Halo games too, so, you know, all that stuff, so... Yeah, so Halo 3, in my heart of heart, is just, it was so great. And I wish Microsoft did a proper remaster for it with their lackluster games this year. Xbox has not released any exclusive was worthwhile this year. A Halo 3 anniversary might have at least gave some people a reason to keep their console. But alas, they gave us the Master Chief Collection, which was a broken mess. Now, what were some of my highlights from Halo 3? Well, most of my friends list consisted of people I played with from Halo 3. And I had some great videos of 
us just messing around. Um, forge mode was a lot of fun. I enjoyed me. I enjoyed the creative people. We would spend. I think I ranked up at least sixty or eighty hours in forge mode alone, which was awesome. Halo Five was okay. The story was pretty bad. The multiplayer was solid, but I mean, for now, Halo is just mediocre now. But back then, Halo was just the best. So. These are my thoughts on Halo 3, guys. Make sure to rate, comment, and subscribe. This is your boy, Eco Gamer. Out!